Now it's been said that the line between love and hate, well, is as thin as a razor's edge. But thinner yet may be the line between victory and what well, defeat. You see, so thin, in fact, that what first appears to be either may it turn out to be the other. Well, for me growing up, it was always the other CI. Grew up in an environment molded on the basis of a Muslim father and crafted onto a foundation of what convenient reality. So no, I wasn't always receptive. Nor was the name Jesus, the Messiah, or Christ in my house always accepted. But through his grace, I was delivered. And now I no longer hold on to these jaded perspectives. See, Islam raised me. But it was through the blood of the lamb that God saved me. See, he comforted my pain. Pain which was waged upon my infant psyche by those who I thought loved me. Inflicted just for the sake of encouraging the quiet assurance a generation of saying Now before you stands a man favored by freedom, yet he's depreciated the agitation. See, I wanted to cry, but didn't want to plow the ground to get it. You see, I wanted the rain, but with no lightning and thunder. You see, I wanted the ocean, but didn't want to deal with the awful roars of its many waters. But Jesus, I said Jesus. Yeah. Jesus. Well, he helped me put them things behind me yeah. and while well, face other issues. But it was a challenge trying to move with a cluttered mental. So the stuff I was into no longer coincides with them things I'm into. Know his life real. See, the Lord paid the cost to be the boss, and well, his blood's real. And his plans don't include in his family with so much potential. Yeah, I'll talk to y'all for a minute. Talk, talk. I'll talk to y'all. Come on. Yeah. Come on, guys. Yeah. Listen, I done had crazy drama from my neighborhood to my family, even worse, from my own mama. See, I used to live life trying to see a dollar till the Lord pulled me in and told me he'd be my father. But I needed to focus up and while trying to get his order straight. Told me I can't chill, nor could I afford to wait. So now, I'm outside chasing souls. Well, today ain't no more souls to chase because my heart aches every time I see a lost face. So my pitfalls, which have shaped my preparation, never seemed positively impactful. Well, till tonight at the New York, <laughs> Come on. So like ingredients comprised to one's favorite treat, unappealing in its original form, so too were the lessons that were vital to my spiritual growth. And all because the Lord dared to say this wretched and downtrodden. So don't let these spoken words that are told too often become words well soon forgotten. See, I heard there's a thin line between love and hate, but thinner yet may be the line between bitterness and faith. But now I know I don't have to have swag to be saved with amazing grace. Yeah. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air.